Sunct and Suna are two rare types of trigeminal autonomic cephalages, with an estimated prevalence of 6.6 .6 out of every 100,000 people. Trigeminal autonomic cephalages are a group of headache types that cause one-sided head and or facial pain, and autonomic symptoms such as a runny or stuffy nose, a sensation of fullness in the ear, facial sweating, and flushing. First, let's discuss sunct. Sunct stands for short-lasting unilateral neuralgia form with conjunctival injection and tearing, meaning short-lasting. Attacks typically last anywhere from one second to 10 minutes. Unilateral, occurs on one side of the head. Neuralgia form, feels like nerve pain. Conjunctival injection, red eye, tearing, generating tears from the eye. Next is SUNA, which stands for short-lasting unilateral neuralgia form with cranial autonomic symptoms. Short-lasting, attacks typically last anywhere from one second to 10 minutes. Unilateral, occurs on one side of the head. Neuralgia form, feels like nerve pain. Autonomic, symptoms are involuntary. To receive a diagnosis of sunct or SUNA, a person must have had at least 20 attacks. Attacks must occur at least once per day. They usually cause moderate to severe pain on one side, around the eye, or in the temporal region of the head, and must include at least one of the cranial autonomic symptoms. A person with sunct must have both a red eye and tearing on the same side as the pain. A person with SUNA must have only one or neither of those eye symptoms. Episodic sunct or SUNA is defined as having attacks that last for a period of seven days to one year, followed by symptom-free periods of three months or more. Chronic sunct or SUNA is defined as having attacks for more than one year without a symptom-free period or with a symptom-free period less than three months. Attacks may occur up to 200 times in one day. People may characterize these attacks as a single or group of stabbing, jabbing, throbbing, shooting, or electric shock-like pains. Some attacks may be triggered by touching the skin on the face or neck movement. An MRI of the brain is needed before diagnosis to check for other causes of symptoms. A provider may also consider imaging the blood vessels of the head to look for abnormalities. Treatment is the same for sunk and SUNA. Acute treatment is difficult because the attacks are so short, but intravenous lidocaine can be helpful. Lamotrigine is a recommended preventive treatment. Other preventive treatments include oxcarbazepine, carbamazepine, gabapentin, tapiramate, and others. For those who do not find relief with these medications, greater occipital nerve blocks and occipital nerve stimulation are alternative options. Unlike paroxysmal hemicrania and hemicrania continua, sunct and suna do not respond to endomethacin. It is important to keep a log of the frequency, duration, and characteristics of your symptoms so your doctor can accurately diagnose this condition. For more information, visit migrainedisorders.org.